Good evening, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my evening news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Take a look at this photo right here. State AG takes control of Hillsborough County Attorney's Office. Decision made after recent criticism of how prosecutions handled. The Hillsborough County Attorney is no longer in charge of his own office after the New Hampshire Attorney General stepped in Friday and appointed someone else to the job. County Attorney Michael Colon will remain in his position, but Attorney General Gordon McDonald has taken control of his office after rising concerns over how Colon is handling cases. Colin was notified of the changes in a letter sent Friday. This office, the Attorney General's office, was assuming the control, direction, and supervision of all criminal prosecutions in Hillsborough County, McDonald said. David Mara, a former Manchester police chief and current drug cars for the state will be named an assistant attorney general and take over operations at the county attorney's office, McDonald said. We are taking the steps necessary to make sure that the people of Hillsborough County are protected through effective leadership at the Hillsborough County attorney's office, he said. Governor Chris Sununu gave his stamp of approval. He's the perfect guy for the job, Sununu said, of Mara. He's going to do a great job, kind of getting the place under control. Colin said the troubles that Pledge Hillsborough County were inherited from previous administrators. You know everybody's in here working every hard in an unreasonable working environment with an outrageous workload based on the negligence of leadership and budget decisions that have been made historically for this office, Colin said. He said he has been working hard to fix those issues since taking office eight months ago. I've been open to any suggestions or resources that the Attorney General's office was willing to make available, he said. Mara's appointment still needs approval by the Executive Council. Until that happens, Deputy Attorney General Jane Young will take charge of the office starting on Monday. And that does it for my evening news report right here on the Riley King Network. I hope you all have a great rest of your evening, and I'll see you back here tomorrow for another news report. Good night and bye.